hi guys welcome back to my channel today we have a pick a card on who is your twin flame as usual pick the pile that resonates with your intuition pile one two and three timestamps will be below and i will see you in your designated pile hi guys and welcome back to my channel Today we have a pick a card on who is your twin flame. Um, if you would like a personal reading, all the um, information is in the description box. And let's get into it. We have the High Priest, Knight of Cups, Ace of Cups. Queen of Pentacles, the Lovers, Page of Wands, the Star, Three of Swords, King of Swords, and Five of Pentacles. Oracle cards will be read at the end, of course. Alright, so we have a Taurus in specific, a Gemini in specific, a Aquarius in specific. We have water signs here, air signs here, and earth signs. Okay, so water, earth, air, Gemini, Aquarius, Taurus in specific. Okay, starting off with the High Priest. And the Knight of Cups, this could definitely be someone that you are in a commitment with. Of course, <clears throat> you could be dealing with a Taurus here, but this could definitely be someone who um, may travel. All right. They may they could um, have a job, a job, a government job. OK, so this person may travel here. I write a lot or they may just be at work a lot um, with the Knight of Cups being here this could definitely be someone you're in a commitment with right now or someone who is just committed um, to something else all right but with the Knight of Cups being here this is someone who is very loving here okay someone who kind of if they are someone who lives at a distance or someone who is far away from you this person will come in bearing gifts or this person is very very loving here as well with the Knight of Cups as well you could be in a separate a separation in your marriage I don't know why I'm getting that so you guys could actually be married here but you guys could be in a separation okay so with the Knight of Cups, this can also be a form of apologies and things of that. I'm hearing giving and receiving here, all right? So you guys could definitely have some type of, um, I'm hearing bond partnership where you always have to give and receive in order to get something done as a um, pair here. So whether that be um, you guys are sharing a house or a mortgage or you guys have a child together or things of that nature here. Um, but I'm definitely getting that. With the Ace of Cups being here, this person is pretty in love with you, okay? You guys are definitely in love with each other here. But with for some of you, I'm definitely seeing that you could definitely be nine months pregnant or you could definitely be about a month. <clears throat> away from giving birth here um we have the ace of cups with the queen of pentacles of course you can be an earth sign if you're a male or a masculine um energy watching this you could be dealing with someone who is an earth sign here or you could be a single mother here okay so you could be someone who is actually co-parenting with this person here so that would bring up the part where you guys are sharing some type of mutual um responsibility okay with the queen of pentacles and the ace of cups here this is a a love okay a really huge offer of love as well here so if you guys are not with this person here if you are separated or segregated okay whereas you guys are living in the same proximity but um things aren't going well i'm seeing that there's going to be a new start and offer of love here made for this person all right if you just got pregnant here you, i'm hearing three months pregnant for some of you or um 
three to four months pregnant here for some of you guys but i'm definitely getting if this person was in the dog house or something um this person wants to come back in and kind of um refresh restart the relationship here okay yes i'm getting heavy um water signs but i'm getting both of you could definitely be earth signs here with like a mutual understanding on basically how to love okay with the lovers here for some of you guys this is a general reading so put your energies where it matches here i have like three different couples here or three different twin flames here or sets here all right i'm getting some of you could definitely be dealing with a gemini energy for some of you this person could be a musician here okay um, with the page of wands here as well, this could be an athlete, a singer, a dancer, a performer. Um, I'm hearing drama club, dramatics, all right, anything of that nature, a producer even, okay. I don't know why I'm hearing Play-Doh or Clay. So someone can be into sculpting as well here, all right? But I'm definitely getting someone here could definitely be a musician of some kind here, okay? Um, someone could definitely make music here that is kind of very um, uplifting in a way or in a sense that it um, kind of um, brings people's vibration up. For some of you, you could actually make um, hurts, like those vibrational tones here that kind of bring people's vibration up or that people listen to while they're meditating with the page of wands being here okay this person is very very attractive here as well um hearing for a lot of you this person could have played sports or been an athlete or this person just has an athletic build here all right but with the lover's card being here as well this is definitely someone here um who you're deeply deeply in love with this is <laughs> the twin flame card okay the soulmate card the divine counterpart card but this person all right is your six your other half here okay because six times two all right is 12 mind body soul here all right so combined together you guys are mind body soul all right um but i'm definitely getting here someone could definitely be a speaker of some kind i'm hearing like a motivational speaker here or um someone can work in a daycare or with kids here as well i'm getting that all right or someone can be a couple therapist um i don't know i'm hearing like ymca or um anything dealing with children here someone could actually be into yoga here as well um or i'm hearing like when you kind of go to the spa here like a masseuse or someone who is um anything dealing with like the naked body here someone could actually do waxing or laser removal here as well here i don't know why i'm getting that but i'm definitely getting something with the naked body for sure here as well here i'm definitely um seeing or visualizing a sort of um i don't know what it's called but it's like basically the area you have where you go to like the spa or whatever i guess it's a sauna and you just have like the towels i'm seeing like robes and towels wrapped around here okay um this person could be very very chill very mellow okay someone here could definitely be um anxiety prone or have um public is that what it's called social anxiety here okay with the star card here and the three of swords here um some of you could have been invested in your twin flame here all right or trying to heal from something else here all right I'm getting surgery for some of you. I don't know why I'm getting that. All right, or your twin flame just went through surgery here. Um, someone could have some type of um, something in their immune system that's um, defector or that is off here, all right? I'm also hearing like some type of disease here, all right, that they have to constantly get surgery for. I don't know why I'm seeing that because I'm literally seeing surgery. The star card here for me, of course, that is a celebrity, all right? But um with these variations being here i'm definitely seeing that this could definitely be someone who gets surgery like and it's kind of healing from the process all right it also has water being here so that is something for someone here that is healed by water 
or uses water therapy in some type of way of course you could be with a healer okay someone who um uses water scrying i'm seeing that as well here someone here has like um a crystal collection a broad crystal collection like not the small crystals but the really big ones so like the big ones are like eighty dollars <laughs> or more all right, but I'm definitely getting for some of you, you could have been with a musician, a um, upcoming celebrity or celebrity in train or a big celebrity here. This person could have backstabbed you, betrayed you or something of that nature here. I'm definitely seeing that it wasn't with. Um, for some of you, it's not going to be with someone who is just this person wanted to just go out and get another spouse. It's just because of the field or the industry that they're in. I'm seeing that, of course, if this person is a rapper, a singer or an entertainer of anything then there are multiple people kind of throwing themselves at this person here so um this person could have definitely betrayed you in some type of way and you could have walked away from this person i'm getting aquarius gemini energy very strongly here with this person all right so half of you will definitely be um earth signs and the other half will be air signs here okay i'm definitely getting you could definitely be dealing with someone who is very fast paced someone who moves a lot here you could definitely be dealing with a doctor as well a surgery doctor okay someone does plastic surgery all right I'm definitely getting that as well but with the five of pentacles and the king of swords here i'm definitely getting that someone wants to change their profession here or someone um someone's profession is about to change here or you just walked away from an air sign here all right um definitely getting that all right but i'm definitely getting that if money was stagnant for you that's going to change as well all right, so I'm trying to make sure I get all the messages that I can kind of see here because I told you guys I would do a description basically of what was going on here or of the person that you're supposed to be with. This video has been requested. I think that's it, y'all. We have life path number sixes here, fives here. All right, life path number ones here. I'm um, hearing twos and threes here. All right, two and three here. If you pick this pile as well here, if you haven't met this person, you're about to meet this person very soon here. I'm hearing in the next two to five months here, two to five weeks here. All right, five days here, two to five days. It's between two and five here. I'm also hearing for some of you during the next full moon here, there's going to be a sporadic change going on within your life here, okay? So let's get into your oracle cards. We have movement this person could definitely be a traveler but i'm definitely getting um this person could be like a free spirit someone who moves a lot someone who is constantly on the go here but like i was saying if you are in a marriage with this person and you guys are, are currently separated here um this person could be moving out or something or they could be wanting to move back in here we have individuality here yeah some of you could be single right now all right um I'm getting for most of you, you actually have met this person, um, whether you guys are separated, whether you guys never date. For some of you, you guys could have only been seeing each other for three to five months, three to five weeks here at the most. Um, some of you could be, could be married to these person. For the people who are married, you could be married to this person for about five years here. But I'm definitely getting um, something dealing with five months. Like I was saying, someone here is definitely five months pregnant, three to five months pregnant as well. But this person is very special, okay? You guys are very both unique here as well. Playful. Yes, whoever was dealing with the um, person who was in the public eye, the celebrity type of figure, the actress, the singer, the performer, the dancer, whatever, this person could definitely be a player here. So um, this person seems to have a lot more um, growing to do, okay? Could definitely be dealing with a Leo here. We have the cat or the feline energy here. We have loyalty. Yeah, for some of you, um, the people who are actually married all right, already here, um, whether you are married or not, um, a twin flame relationship, if it is indeed a real twin flame, twin flame relationship, okay? Um, a lot of times in the spiritual community, it's kind of confusing or it gets confused here 
because twin flames are actually very very rare all right i'm not gonna say very very rare but they're really rare all right than a lot of us um want to believe actually okay but just to say um be aware of people who pose as your twin flames so this comes in the act of narcissists or you know abusers or just things of that nature here okay because um there's a confusing element with the twin flame dynamic so they want to tell you that there's a runner chaser dynamic here so someone is constantly running away from the connection while someone is constantly kind of like running after or chasing after this person and kind of like trying to get this person to see what the connection is about all right um be aware if this person um is definitely a narcissist because narcissists actually embody a lot of those type of elements or qualities within themselves as well here okay so a narcissist really likes um supply so this will also be in the dynamic of runner and chaser so just be aware and be alert to you know if this person is truly your divine counterpart your twin flame whatever or if this person is indeed a narcissist or someone of very toxic lower vibes all right so we have loyalty this person is very loyal to you especially for the ones that are pregnant right now the ones that are definitely in the marriage here okay but I'm definitely getting heavy Leo energy. But if you're if this person isn't isn't a Leo, this person could just embody the Leo qualities here. So this is just you know being very very courageous, being very strong here, all right? Being very loyal, all right. This person is a lover. I'm hearing lover boy, lover girl. And lastly, have strength here, all right? A very very strong connection, okay? So, pal number one, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope it resonated. Alright, if you have any questions, alright, you can email me. My email is definitely in the description box along with any other questions or things that you guys need to know. Alright, love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you picked pile number two, this is your pile. If you guys um, are in need of a personal reading, anything of that nature, okay? Um, all the information is in my description box. Alright, so let's just get into it. Oracle cards will be read at the end as usual. We have Ace of Wands, Five of Wands, Six of Wands, King of Pentacles, the Empress, Page of Pentacles, the Chariot, Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, and Seven of Swords. All right. So we have heavy fire energies, we have heavy earth energies, we have a Taurus, Libra, Capricorn in specific. I'm hearing a Libra, Capricorn in specific here. All right, we also have Virgos here as well. We have the Cancer here or Cancer here and Pisces here as well. We have all the water signs. So we have fire, water, and earth, right? Starting off, we have the Ace of Wands and the Five of Wands, all right? So starting off, this could be your twin flame. Could add, you could have just met this person here. I'm hearing within the last month or the last five through six weeks here, all right, for some of you. For some of you, you've actually been um, knowing this person for up to 10 years or 10 months here, okay? But for some of you, most of you, it won't be anything that is more than a year here, all right? For a lot of you, if you just met this person here in the last couple of months, I'm hearing between 
one through five months well one through six months or one through six weeks here all right but a lot of you it will be over um one week here a lot of you it's starting with literally one through um six months here all right but a lot of you have known each other for about five through six weeks here Oh, you or you guys been talking for this long okay so you actually could have met this person about 10 months ago here all right or five <laughs> you could have met this person 10 months all right 10 months ago but I'm getting that you guys could have been talking now for about five through six weeks all right you could have just went on a date here within the last week or so all right I don't really think there's many people quarantining as much as everyone wants to believe that all right so with the ace of wands here and the five of wands here this person could definitely be a musician here I'm hearing a singer here if this person is if, the, if this person actually doesn't do this as a job or a profession this person just could be a very very great singer here someone has a very nice delicate um sexy voice I'm hearing as well this person could actually have a lot of options all right a lot of um people who want to get at this person here with the five of wands being here this is almost as if this person kind of makes you fight for their attention or you feel like you have to fight for this person's attention in some way right so this could be how this person feels about you or this could be how you feel about this person all right put your energies where they belong this is a general reading so i'm getting there's at least two different sets of twin flames here all right so i'm definitely getting for some of you this person makes you feel as if you have to fight for their um, attention here or for their time, their energy, things of that nature here. For some of you, I'm actually getting that when you guys started dating or when you guys started talking here, it was smooth, it was easy here. But then as things progressed, different people and different friends just kind of started popping up here, right? Because with the six here and the five here, that equals 11 here, that's two, all right? That's friendships, that's partnerships, all right? So this person could have hella business partners, hella friends, all right? Um, of different sexes here as well, I'm getting that, all right? So whether this be this person's, you have to fight off other people or this person is constantly having to fight off other people here because I don't know why, I'm getting this could be on social media for some reason. I don't know if you guys are feeling nervous, but if you're feeling nervous, all right, or if you're feeling anxious, all right, um, it's okay. Just take deep breaths here, all right, or if this person may make you feel nervous or anxious here because you really kind of don't know what's going on with this person or if you don't know if you're reading this person right or this connection right, all right. But with the Ace of Wands here and the Five of Wands, I'm literally seeing like DMs, messages popping up on this person's phone here. It's like new, like every day here, all right? Next, we have Six of Wands here and the King of Pentacles, all right? So this person could definitely be um, very well established, very affluent here, all right? Or this person um, I'm hearing could just be very well invested in their um, career here, all right? This person could definitely be in the public eye here, but I'm just getting like this person here that could be a builder, that could build houses here, all right? I'm hearing real estate here. I'm hearing firms here, all right? This person um, could make houses or remodel houses as well here. Someone could definitely be into Forex, foreign exchange, things right. like that. So I just heard a message here, like this person, you may be talking to them on the phone or something and they feel like they have to call you back or you, they always have to call you back or they always have to see you later or they always have to reschedule or something like that, all right? But I'm definitely getting that this person, um, I'm hearing a mogul here, all right? They could actually work in like a firm, a big law firm. This person could be a lawyer or a judge or something of that nature. I don't know why I'm hearing that, all right? <clears throat> but I'm definitely getting, for some of you, you're definitely working or dealing with or in a connection with someone who is big boss, big business here, all right? I'm actually visualizing like a round table or a table where everyone's kind of discussing things, all right? Um, 
to be kind of projected to an audience or projected to a, a jury or something of that nature right but i'm definitely getting this person here i don't know why i'm hearing press here this person could work into in politics or press or activism or anything of that nature here i'm getting higher ranks all right higher social ranks as well all right i'm definitely getting um this person can definitely be very wealthy here or this person is just very well established here i'm hearing um i8 bmw i8 I'm hearing a mercedes here this person has a very very nice car here this person can have very broad shoulders as well all right but with the six of wands here for some of you this one that won't be for all of you all right but I'm definitely getting, there's a couple here that's highly established here. And there's actually a couple here that this person actually just comes from a very wealthy family. So a lot of the things that this person has is kind of like handed down to them, all right? Because their family is established, their father is established, all right? Their father could be well known into politics, any of that nature. But this person could have a big social media influence here or they could be on social media or highly known or well known in your area, your city, what have you. This person here, they could get a lot of attention here with the Six of Wands or they just want a lot of attention. All right, so be aware of that. I'm hearing this person could be an energy junkie. So if this person is someone who actually likes a, a lot of attention here, all right? This person, all right, coming out as a seven of wands energy, this person is someone who kind of knows what they want here. They're very stern, all right? They're not going to really um, kind of shift from their reality of what they feel like they want and they deserve here, all right? Especially if this person is from a well-off family, a family where they kind of got everything that they want, all right? Um, this person's morals and standards are very very high i'm getting that all right but if you are attracting this person here which you are with the empress card that is the most high vibrating counterpart as a feminine energy that can be in the deck or that is in the deck here all right either you come from a royal family as well or this person here all right either you or this person here one of you do or both of you do but i'm definitely getting that someone's family owns multiple businesses or i'm also hearing like a car lot as well all right but i'm definitely getting that if you're not if you don't come from a wealthy family you could actually um be someone who in a past life here was of royal status here or you worked with celebrities or you were a celebrity yourself or a princess yourself here because the empress is a queen a princess here all right um, especially when you have this type of configuration of cards laying out. So next we have the Empress in Page of Pentacles here. All right, this person, you guys could actually have a child together here. Your child could be an Earth sign. All right, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. All right, but I'm definitely seeing that this person could already have a child here or you could already have a child here before actually meeting this person here i'm seeing one child here so either you guys are going to have a child together here someone's pregnant here or either this person has a child here it could really be this person they could have a child already or you could have a child already all right but I'm definitely seeing a child here that will be shared here. So um, if you guys both have children already here, there's actually going to be one more child here, all right, coming into flourishing. But if you guys, if one person has a child here, I'm definitely getting um, some type of co-parenting going on or another child is definitely going to be brought here, all right, because we have the page of pentacles here. All right, and this is um, embodying both of your energies here, very grounded, very stable here. So, but I'm definitely getting, um, of course you could be, you could work with your hands here. I'm hearing, um, you could actually make clothing or you could be really into, um, I don't know why I'm hearing martial arts for some of you guys. This person could be into that, all right, or boxing. I don't know why I was hearing that as well. But I'm definitely getting someone here has their own garden here. Someone works with their hands. Someone crafts things. Someone molds things, all right. You could definitely work with the younger children here, young athletes here, young um, gifted children here, all right. Because the page of pentacles here is a gift here, all right. Of course, this person could shower you in gifts as well. I'm seeing that. 
all right so say for instance you found something in this person's phone or you feel as if this person isn't giving you enough attention here this person will buy you gifts here and things of that nature i'm definitely seeing that especially <laughs> with the page of pentacles being here the ten of pentacles this is like 10 different gifts or this is gifts like every day of the week type of thing so say for if this person is indeed a traveler all right for some of you these people will be travelers all right especially if they are working in big businesses so going on um business trips and things this person might actually bring you back souvenirs and things of that nature we have the chariot of course you'd be dealing with a cancer here all right this person could actually have a very secretive family or you feel as if these this person has um a lot of things that is hidden within the family here i'm getting that there's a lot of things that this person may do that you're not aware of here all right because with the chariot being here it's not the moon here but cancer energies always remind me of it's like motherly energies here cancer rules like the motherly world and things dealing with the family and domestic life all right so this person could come from two different backgrounds or this is you of course i'm getting you could definitely come from two different backgrounds here someone here is mulatto all right but someone has a huge family all right someone lives someone's family's house is like a lot of rooms and it's like a lot of people in the family kind of live there at one time all right, or your family could, I don't know, I'm hearing Massachusetts, Mississippi, Minnesota, something with the M, your name could start with the M, this person's name could start with the M, this person's business can start with the M, but I'm definitely getting an M here. Your child or the child that you, I'm hearing Mustafa as well here. Don't know why, but I'm definitely getting that with the chariot being here. This person makes a lot of big moves, all right? A lot of big business deals as well here. I'm definitely getting someone here is a bodybuilder or a traveler as well here. Um, and if this person is an entrepreneur, this person probably has a lot of clients here. For some of you, I'm definitely getting you could definitely be a trophy wife, all right? Next, we have the Queen of Cups and Seven of Swords here. All right, so with these two <laughs> combinations, two things can be possible. This person could be lying about basically who they're giving their time to, who they're giving their attention to, all right, why people are texting them, why people are calling them, why people are messaging them, being so nice, all right. I'm hearing at night, but I'm hearing at 7 o'clock a.m. or 7 o'clock at night or something. I don't know. I'm hearing 7 o'clock. Or why this person always has to leave at seven o'clock who knows here i'm also hearing something about an assistant here but for others of you guys i'm definitely getting um this person has a kind of sneaky nature I'm definitely getting that all right um but this person has a lot of money all right but i'm getting like if you already like if you're established with this person and you kind of know this person could be lying about something they have a sneaky nature here it's almost as if like you don't say anything or you don't cause as much conflict here because with the five of wands here this is still arguments things of that nature this is like almost arguing like constantly every day but i'm de definitely getting here you kind of stay in the predicament because of the um financial gains or the financial living areas things of that nature here for some of you i'm hearing that you've been in this um type of luxury life here that you kind of don't know like how to start over go back all right so it's almost as if when you try to walk away or you try to start something new or maybe you try to do the same thing that this person does here it's almost as if you have you find yourself being in conflict with yourself here all right because i'm definitely getting that all right if you are working with someone who is in big business here this is literally like the best person in the business here like this person is very sought after all right i'm um, hearing this person could work i'm hearing ukraine china things of that nature i don't know why but for others of you, this person just strategizes or wants to strategize basically how to make you happier, how to give their love to you. For some of you, I'm also hearing that this person could have grew up in a family here where there is a lot of deception going on. Right? Um, I'm getting like this person's family could have used money as love here so this person kind of doesn't really know how to love all right so it's almost as if you're kind of teaching this person here but this person almost has to kind of i'm hearing like mask 
or like copy and paste. I'm hearing that. All right, so let's get into your Oracle cards. We have High Priestess of Air. You can definitely be dealing with someone who is a Grand Earth Trine, someone who has lots of elements in the same planetary bodies in the earthly um, zodiac signs here. But definitely getting someone here is the High Priestess of Earth. Someone knows how to really manifest money here. Definitely getting that. Definitely getting Earth signs here as well here. We have a groove. I'm hearing a man cave here. Someone has a man cave here. Someone just always is in their office here. Or someone may have did something they need to apologize. The groove here is someone's, of course, it could mean groove. You're in your groove. You're doing your thing. But the groove is usually apologies like in the book. I don't know where the book. Here's the book. It says... I want to read you guys this. I guess it's important. Heal your wounds and mend your heart. Now is the time to apologize to anyone you have harmed. Make your friendship whole again and choose healing over anger and pain. Choosing your beautiful groove is a powerful sign that you are at wondrous and you are at a wondrous and strong time in your life. Show compassion and kindness to others. No one is perfect, yet imperfection is perfect as it is. All right, if you are hurting, know that this will pass and that I watch over you. If someone you love is hurting, take this time to be there for this person. The sacred groove heals all aches and pains, especially a heart that has been wounded here. All right, so if this person is constantly lying to you, all right, um, and trying to you basically use gifts as amendments here. All right, I'm getting there's going to be healing in the situation, definitely. We have rigid here like i said this person is really really into um the finer things here but this person could be very very um i don't know i don't i'm hearing rough around the edges but not on the outside here this person could just really be kind of like a control freak or like they really really just want what they want but you see with the rigid card here it's almost as if this wall is built with a whole bunch of rocks here so this person um grew up in a very solid foundation or this person has just built a very solid foundation from their souls and for their souls and they kind of don't want to kind of distinguish from that but with this the wall up here there you could feel like there's a wall in between you guys or something of that nature here as well we have forbidden here all right so definitely something going on behind closed doors here or there could be or you feel that way all right especially with the seven of swords here this is lies this is deception here as well all right but something forbidden here and it, it came out right under the groove so if this person is doing something forbidden all right especially if you guys are in a commitment you guys have children here all right things of that nature here i'm definitely getting that um this person is going to apologize or make it up to you in some type of way i hope we have understanding you guys definitely understand each other okay this person understands you and you really understand this person here for some of you i'm getting this person may be hard to do with just because um of their standards or just because of the way that they are here definitely getting for a lot of you this person could definitely be a control freak things of that nature all right or they just like things in order or they just like things to go kind of the way that they um want it to all right so pile number three this is mm, pile number two this is your pile all right um if you guys have any questions or concerns okay you guys can definitely email me my email is in the description box hi pile three and welcome back to my channel if you are a new subscriber here, all right, um, hi, thank you for subscribing. If you're an old subscriber here, welcome back, all right. Um, if you need a personal reading, if you have any questions or concerns here, my email, the um, information is in my bio, all right. Today we have a pick card on who is your twin flame plus the description of this person, all right. Oracle cards will be read at the end. We have King of Cups. We have Eight of Pentacles, we have the Moon, we have Five of Cups, <clears throat> we have Seven of Pentacles, we have the High Priestess, we have 
Seven of Wands. We have Queen of Swords. We have Page of Cups and Eight of Swords. All right, so we have a Pisces, a Cancer in specific here. All right, we have Earth signs and we have Air signs here. All right, so Water, Earth, Air. All right. I have shadow messages for you guys, so I'm hearing um, a rush of energy here is being bestowed upon you. Maybe you have this energy today, or maybe when you see this person, um, this is the energy that you feel around them here. All right, this person could be very, very um, energetic here as well. I'm getting that. I'm definitely getting that. Um, for some of you, you're dealing with the Scorpio as well. We actually have all water signs here. All right. I'm hearing Virgo Taurus here in specific here. Some of you can have Capricorn, Capricorn in your chart here. All right. But a lot of you, some of you will definitely be Sun Signs, Virgo or Taurus. All right. Getting a lot of Pisces Moon here. All right. Life path number sevens here. Definitely in life path number eights here. We have a, life, a lot of life path number fives that are watching this um, reading today as well. All right, so let's get started. We have King of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. So I'm definitely, I'm hearing Master Healer here. But with the King of Cups being here, I'm definitely getting this could definitely be a water sign you work with, a water sign you work around here. If you guys don't work together, if you guys don't work around each other, you guys may um, do the exact same work here, all right? But I'm definitely getting this could be someone that you met at work, someone that you will meet at work. Um, I'm hearing that for some of you, you actually haven't met this person here, but a lot of you, all right, 80% of you, you actually have met this person here. All right, for some of you, you're actually getting out of another relationship here. Um, someone that was a false twin or someone that you thought was a twin, all right, they're not actually your twin, all right, you haven't even met this person yet. I'm getting you're going to meet this person at your work, and if you don't meet this person at your work here, this person does the exact same work here, all right? Whether you know it or whether they don't tell you, but you might actually sense it from this person here, all right? This could definitely be someone who wears red a lot, or this could be someone who wears very royal colors a lot, all right? You could actually be dealing with someone who is a Leo North Node, someone who actually embodies um, the sacral chakra, so someone who is very powerful but silent here. This is someone that if you get in their presence, you can tell that they have things on their mind, or you can just really read their energy, especially if this person is um, someone who, especially if you here with the high priestess is someone in the spiritual community a psychic a tarot reader a recce healer anything dealing with the spiritual realm here all right you can definitely be able to sense energy someone here is a very strong empath clear sentient all right definitely getting that light worker here you're a bit you'll definitely be able to um i'm hearing read this person's mind almost so with the moon card being here and the five of cups here there's a cancer somewhere that's missing you <laughs> Or there is um, a secret that this person or you could be holding back from, all right? It could definitely be that this person is into occult magic, occultism, all right? This person studies the hidden realms here. This person is into crazy things here. Um, I'm hearing apocalypse and zombies for some reason, all right? I'm hearing one other thing, but I don't want to say it actually in this video here, all right? But, um... I'm hearing targeted as well, but there's a cancer here that you could have just walked away from here, all right? Um, this person could have been giving you very, very little here, or this person just was not giving you enough here. I'm hearing a dream, a fantasy, and a wish, all right? Or a dick, okay? Um, with the moon card being here, someone here is very, very empathic, or someone here is very intuitive, someone here moves with the moon cycles here, or someone feels very shifty here. All right, if you met this person here within the last seven through eight months, all right, um, you could actually have been knowing this person for a while now. You actually just didn't know that this person was your twin. Excuse me here. I'm hearing for some of you guys could have just met this person um, seven to eight months ago, or you're going to meet this person seven to eight months in seven to eight months. Um, the month September is specific, and October is very specific here. Right? 
I'm getting Halloween here as well. All right. So if this person is being shifty with you or if this person has ever been shifty with you, I'm definitely getting that this person is feeling remorseful about that. All right. You could have actually cut off communication with this person here because you felt like this person was just like the others here. And I'm getting this person is kind of like, I can't explain this person's energy, but this person has a very strong energy, especially with the King of Cups and the Moon here being side by side. It's almost as if this person I'm hearing is explosive. It's almost as if like this person is feeling so much energy here. But like when you guys get around each other, this person may be dead silent here or they may not express the emotions that they have or they're just, I don't know, like it's almost as if you know something's on their mind, but they they don't say it or they don't say half of anything that you would assume that would, something, that would be something that they should say here. All right. Um, I'm getting for some of you in the next seven to eight days here something's going to happen seven to eight weeks seven and eight here is very specific here for you guys seven to eight days seven to eight weeks and seven to eight months I'm not getting seven to eight years here but I'm definitely getting someone could have been studying a certain practice here for seven to eight years here all right or since they were eight or seven here someone's been interested in something all right it could be occultism or the hidden rooms the hidden knowledge all right things of that nature here <laughs> I keep hearing this one word, but I'm not going to say it. Um, with the King of Cups here, I, fuck it, I'm going to say it. I keep hearing Illuminati, like I keep hearing that. And now it's like dead silent, like, that's crazy. Um... Also, I'm definitely getting that this person here, all right, they're just very, very mysterious here. They feel that way about you, all right? It's almost as if I can read this person's energy or read y'all's energy here without even, like, having to tell you step from step to step to step of each card here, okay? This person's energy is very, very easy to tap into here. It's almost as if, because a lot of times if you share the same type of, um, planetary bodies with someone, whether that be you guys have the same moon sign or the same, um... I keep hearing air sign. You guys could both be very intellectual here, all right? But I'm de definitely getting um, Gemini energy, Aquarius energy here. I'm getting really heavy Scorpio energy. Even if this person is not a Scorpio, they embody Scorpio type of energy here, all right? Very seductive, very seductive here. For me, I don't know why it's very easy for me to read Scorpio energy, but Scorpio energy is one of the energies that I feel personally is very in depth like out of all the people i've been around out of all the signs i've been around i've actually been in um connections not rather love connections i'm saying like friend connections associate connections here but scorpio is the most in-depth intriguing um easiest um sign for me to tap into here but it's always the most frightening sign all right because scorpios rule the the mind all right so it's always really easy for me to kind of like hear what they're thinking and it's kind of creepy actually so you may actually be feeling like you hear this person's thoughts or something or it's just really weird all right you could think that you're reading this person here but when they say something you're like what the fuck like that's nothing what i thought here but and you are reading this person here it's just this person is not an open book at all right we have the seven of pentacles and the high priestess here all right I'm definitely getting here this person could have been with someone for about or this person here okay I'm hearing this for some of you either this person or you could have just stopped working with occult knowledge occultism all right and the spiritual realm whatever here I'm getting you still do your own thing here but a lot of you are focusing on like crystal healing like meditations yoga things of that nature i don't know why i'm hearing that i'm really hearing Ricky here but i'm definitely getting um y'all's reading is just like kind of dark i'm really trying so hard not to go that way because every time i talk about things like that i always get spiritual warfare on my videos like every single time even if i tap like a little into it so yeah this energy is strong here. You guys have a very strong energy. You guys are really strongly 
compelled here you guys like literally belong there but um someone could have just walked away from this type of job here maybe because it got too dark here or they were just sensing things or feeling things or that was just too strong or just going down the wrong path here all right but i'm definitely getting um you could definitely be um a spiritualist for about seven months here seven years here all right or you just started a spiritual job here about seven months ago here we have two sevens here seven seven we have two eights here eight eight this is a spiritual path this is someone who was supposed to you're supposed to encounter on your spiritual path this is also someone that's going to help you grow here all right we have jupiter energy i'm also hearing saturn energy as well Batman could be very specific here because I don't know why I'm hearing Batman too. I'm just hearing, <laughs> I'm hearing underdog. I'm hearing just this person could be very, I can't explain it. For some of you, this person could be very dark. But I'm not getting this as a bad person, all right? Yeah, I'm about to stop reading y'all's energy. <laughs> Cause I'm hearing like some kind of weird creepy things like like I don't even have to like that's so weird I'm hearing like dissection here someone is into dissection here I'm about to hurry up and finish y'all's reading here because y'all shit's kind of creepy here. And I'm not even going to lie. Alright, anyways. So I'm definitely getting that um, you've invested a lot of energy into the spiritual community. I'm going to really try to keep this on a very mundane level, alright? Um, I'm hearing it's not mundane. You guys are not... A lot of people that pit this pile is not really mundane here. But I'm going to keep it, try to keep it mundane here for YouTube purposes and for the um vibration of this video purposes all right so we have the seven of wands here um someone has a gift here of tapping into different dimensions i'm definitely getting that all right um with the seven of wands here and the queen of swords here this could be someone that you blocked here but i'm definitely getting this could be the person that you blocked could have been your ex here your ex could have definitely been a um air sign or this person was just very cold i'm hearing bitchy i'm hearing lazy i'm hearing aggravating <laughs> all right i don't know why i'm hearing that all right this person could constantly be trying to fight off the another air sign or someone like this all right from trying to get to y'all's connection here all right i'm getting y'all's energy is so strong here because um you guys are both water signs for most of you you guys will both be water signs here definitely getting that all right we have the Page of Cups here and the Eight of Swords here, right? Um, but I really like y'all's energy because I was feeling like this kind of throughout the video. This probably was coming from y'all's energy, but I don't think so. Throughout the in throughout the video, I was feeling very kind of like anxious or nervous, I guess, and it was weird. But um, y'all's energy is kind of like calming me down because it's almost as like it's sucking me in. It's weird. But we have the Eight of Swords here and the Page of Cups here. This person, you could have um, cut off this person. Someone here is of same sex. Here is someone deals with the same sex um, partners, all right? Um, you could have cut off this person here because they're very flirtatious here. They may even be flirting with people at the job, flirting with people that they work here, all right? Someone here works in um, the jail systems or someone works as like a security guard someone here is could, could really be a police officer when i see the eight of swords i always i always envision bars all right for some reason i'm seeing like you know you see on those movies and like the person's like having the cup like against the bars i'm literally seeing that so someone could actually be um i don't know what those people are called here but that's probably why your energy is so dark because if you if you work in a prison a prison house or a jail house or a prison all right the inmates all right they're very 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 they can be very disgusting here like not in like a sexual way but just like um words like just very vile here all right so i'm definitely getting wherever you work here it's something that you work at night here or this person does all right or if you go see this person here it's at night here all right but i'm definitely getting that um this part y'all energy all right but i'm definitely getting that this person here 
Lord. Someone really likes bats here or some shit like that. Someone here is like just very into dark things. Just just that on that. That's just this person here. Or someone is around very dark people, very low vibe people, especially if you work in a jailhouse and especially if you are a um woman, all right, or a feminine energy. I'm literally seeing someone who is a prison guard. All right. But I'm definitely getting that this person, someone that you could have left excuse me could have made you feel very um trapped within your mind all right someone could have played played a lot of mind games here <laughs> this person y'all be careful with this person here i don't know who this is here if this person had just broke up with the queen of swords here um this person could be trying to do some type of binding magic or binding some spell on you all right or something of that <laughs> nature all right, because with the A of Wanted, that's binding to me. And it's like this person has it behind your, their back here. So if you're the same sex, be very aware of this person here. Or be aware of this person's ex. Or be aware of your ex and your ex's mistress or something. I don't really know. I'm kind of done with y'all. All right, so literally, y'all, I'm not kidding. At the, at the bottom of the deck, we have Summon. Yeah. First of all, someone's into very dark shit. Like, that is what it is. I'm not gonna go into it. <laughs> not only do we have some of y'all, we have 13. If y'all really with the shits, if y'all know what I'm talking about, 13, summon. Someone's into very dark things. I'm hearing someone is a wizard. I really don't want to get into this type of stuff because every time I do this, it's cool though. Anyways, some in here, someone's trying to call you in here. Someone has manifested you here. We have fragments, all right? Someone's last relationship was a shit show or just all over the place or someone here is healing from their last relationship, all right? We have trapped here. Yeah, like I said, someone wants to trap you here. Um, someone from the past, though, I'm really getting that. I don't think it's this person. I'm getting it's someone that either they dealt with in the past to trap to trap them or someone's trying to do binding. All right, someone could have a bird. I promise you, I don't want to even say what I was hearing. I was literally hearing someone is dissecting animals, but they could have like animals trapped. <laughs> I'm not tapping into y'all's energy like anymore. Y'all got weird, really weird energy, or this person does, or someone that's attached to y'all's energy has it very dark energy i'm just telling y'all that so be aware of that please we have trapped here so much yeah whatever we have differences here you guys may come from very different backgrounds here or you're very different than um anyone that this person's experienced here all right i'm definitely getting your light worker here all right even if you are into the same things with this person here you're of the light here all right um but we have the black cat and the white cat here it's weird because the black cat is kind of just you know there all right um there's a lot of superstitions on black cats black cats are actually good luck things of that nature as well but we have the white cat of purity looking at the black cat all right so someone here is dark someone here is light literally um someone here could be of lighter complexion someone here can be of a darker complexion of course as the mundane things go um with the eating thing I'm not <laughs> getting into that. I'm not. We have obedience. This person could be very obedient to um their craft here or whoever this person's dealing with may be really obedient to being with them. Definitely getting don't eat anything from this person within the first um nine months. If you guys are going to go out, um go out to a restaurant all right so power number three someone's name could definitely be zach as well i'm getting i'm hearing an e as well as a b i'm hearing bb i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions any concerns here all right um my email is in my description box all right i love you guys and i will see you guys in my next